Plena Aero, a Korean startup founded by the man who oversaw Hyundai, early Supernol's eVTOL program, is developing a new long-range hybrid electric VTOL air taxi with a range of up to 350 miles, 500 kilometers, and a top speed of 217 miles per hour, 350 kilometers per hour, that can carry up to seven passengers. To that end, Plena has just completed a pre-Series A investment round, bringing the total amount of money invested in the company to nearly 10 million, or more precisely, 11.8 billion Korean won, or about USD 8.3 million. That's not nothing, and it's enough to get the business through the construction of a scaled-down battery electric aircraft prototype. The machine depicted in the concept art is striking in appearance, with a long, slender fuselage that curves upward into the main wing and a pair of canards that protrude from the main tube at the machine's nose. Large, electric, swiveling propellers with five blades provide propulsion and a fully vectored thrust design. When in hover mode, the configuration resembles a hexacopter due to the six rotors, two on the canards, two on the leading edges of the main wing, and the third pair closer to the fuselage on the trailing edge of the main wing. For vertical takeoff and landing, VTOL, the rear two props tilt down, while the front four props tilt up. That's because when in cruise mode, they're set up as pusher props, not aft tilting ones like the others. That's great for aerodynamics, but it puts those big propellers at a level where people could get hurt if they tripped over them. Plana doesn't appear worried. It looks like the front canard props will be just as tall and capable of delivering a chest-high slice and dice. I guess we should put some nice striped yellow lines on the vertipad in the budget. The plane appears to be an excellent contender for the role of regional air minibus because of its size, hybrid power, long range, and relatively high speed. Many eVTOL manufacturers aim for commercial certification and entry into service by 2024, so Plana will be playing catch-up. Based on their timeline, Plana hopes to have a prototype aircraft ready by 2024 and a fully certified machine ready for mass production by 2028. That's it for today, and as always, make sure to like, subscribe, and check our website at www.techwiki.co. Thanks for watching.